Hi guys, it's Jill from Ocean Spirit again, and this is Chloe. She's going to drop in to Peribe Aquarium. Full of fish, look at that. Beautiful blue blanded snappers wherever you look. She's absolutely thrilled and excited because this is what she came to look at. Millions of fish. She doesn't know, but I can see. There are no big fish here, where are they? We think that they've been fished out and these are new fish that have come in to take their place. Last year we had the most shocking infestation of algae. The fishermen took all the big fish and then they took the smaller fish and the tiny corals who have a very very small pipe that enables them to breathe became smothered with, with algae and they were unable to breathe and they died. The algae covered the corals. There's several types. Look at this. It's disgusting. It's all over the reef. Look at this. Coral covered in algae. Every single algae-eating fish has been taken from this. But strangely, the reef knows what's happening. The reef knows it must recover. And buried in the sand are millions of fish's eggs. And these are beginning to hatch. Everywhere we looked, in crevices and crannies. There were peppercorns of tiny, tiny hatchlings. And these little guys began to grow. And what did we see? A massive, huge covering of fish. As far as the eye could see, it was just dense hatchings of different species of algae-eating fish. The reef was repairing itself. Look at this. I called our friend and photographer Thomas Vignord, who made all those movies about the sharks and the Serenity Project, and Thomas was completely blown away by the way these reefs looked. He came out with his huge camera and he spent an entire hour filming fish, tiny fish, from huge sharks to tiny fish, with great excitement. We were thrilled to see how this reef had recovered. Sometimes nature just performs a miracle, and this was it. The big fish started to come in. There's a lionfish hunting. And as they grow, so the big fish grow, and bigger fish come in to eat them. And the balance of the reef is beginning to be restored. And as the shoals grow, so more shoals come in. Look at this kingfish hunting. Shortly we're hoping to see barracuda after this lockdown is over. We can't wait to get back in the water again and share what we see with you guys. This is how diving can be in Mauritius and this is a miracle because the reef knew it was sick. It knew it needed help. The fish laid the eggs and they hatched when the algae got too bad and now look at the corals growing again. Cheers, Chloe. We hope you enjoyed your dive and we hope we see you again.